Hi everyone. This is a video about my smart TV box. It the name is TV Box Android 5.1 RK3368 octa-core and 64-bit CPU. Uh, as you see, I have modified this a little bit. I explain to you why. This does, uh, you know, something strange. And I tell you what. When I check the memory on this, it says 2 gigabytes of RAM, 2 gigabytes of ROM, and 16 gigabyte of internal memory, which of those 11 gigabyte is free. So 2 gigabyte of RAM, 2 gigabyte of ROM, and 11 gigabyte of free internal memory. But it it says it recognizes the ROM as SD card. I don't know what is wrong with this. That's why I have made this video for anyone who knows what is the problem with this machine. Just let me know and you know leave a comment on the comment section and let me know how they can help me. So first of all it was this was a good machine until it started to uh, just freeze and froze uh, after four or five hours of con uh, continuous use and uh, I thought maybe it is a heating issue that's why I have put this uh, fan to cool it down I made a hole let me just get my torch I show you I made a hole underneath with a step drill and I installed this fan on the top which is blowing in there if it was another way round the fan blade was rubbing against the surface of the top and it would just make noises and damaging the fan and the blade so this fan is 12 volt and I'm not using the device to power it up and I'm using a separate 12 volt for this fan so and since then it just does a little bit better it's, it just goes on for six to seven hours on my test and it does much better but still there is an issue and the issue is it uses that ROM as the cache allocated area cache allocated area and all the time I have to clear up my cache and you know close up all most of the uh, apps that they are running at the background so um, this is a very good machine but unfortunately there is a flow in there and the flow is the ROM that is 2 gigabyte and using it as a uh, SD card when I uh, install an app on this and I have Android Assistant on this as Android Assistant is advising me to move it to the SD card while there is no SD card in there 
and I have no idea. And when I put a SD card, I have bought a very good SD card for this. And when I put it on, it, it can't see it. And you cannot move any apps on it. I don't know what the purpose of that SD slot, micro SD card slot, is there. But, unfortunately, you know, I need some help. And uh, if you know anything about this machine, please let me know. And, you know, the fan, it works well, but I'm using external, you know, power source for this. So, if anyone knows about this, uh, please let me know how I can, you know, maybe use the internal memory which is 11 gigabyte free at the moment and I have nothing in there nothing on uh, that is going to you know uh, exhaust the internal memory uh, just maybe five or six apps on this no games nothing so I'm not um, overloading this machine and I need some help and if you uh, know what is wrong with this please let me know thanks for your watching until my next video take care of yourself and each other